And then I was like, this is ridiculous. Why, why aren't there better products available for all babies in the hospital? A mother from Duxbury on a mission to revolutionize the treatment of hospitalized infants. It is a movement born out of one of the most challenging experiences of her life. Clothing designer Kate Bowen had a healthy pregnancy, but just weeks before the birth of her fourth child, everything changed. I knew something was wrong. You could sense it. Something was off. Kate Bowen was 36 weeks pregnant when doctors discovered the baby's heart racing at over 300 beats per minute. They needed to deliver that night. But as Georgia Claire was born, she had a heart attack. When she came out of the womb, I saw her and she looked gray. Doctors spent 25 minutes performing CPR on little Georgia. And she was so sick that we weren't even sure if she would survive a transplant. Georgia spent the next six months living in the hospital, hooked up to wires, tubes, and lines, keeping her alive. It was difficult to dress her while she was in the hospital, and we wanted her to be as comfortable as possible while she fought for her life every day. After months of cutting clothes to accommodate the medical equipment keeping Georgia alive, Kate took her knowledge of design and created a brand new version of the hospital Johnny. She called it the Georgie. The Georgie is a kimono style. The onesie doesn't need to be removed for doctors to check on those little patients. It's made of soft yet strong bamboo fabric that can contain the wires with no metal snaps so it's MRI and x-ray compatible. She thought of all of those things so that it wouldn't have to be taken off and on many times throughout the day. The Georgie is now the subject of a clinical trial at Boston Children's Hospital, and thanks to social media, it's already getting plenty of attention. What has been really remarkable is I've had nurses, um, not only from children's, but from across the country, reach out saying that they would love the Georgie at their hospital. I think the difference in this innovation is that it's really about how can we improve the life of the child, not just keep them alive. We're so proud of you, Georgie. She's doing great. Georgie did receive her heart transplant. She's growing at home with her sisters and her big brother. And as for the Georgie, Nordstrom has placed an order to put it in its stores. Mm. And Children's Hospital hopes to finish the trial, the clinical trial, very soon and then start rolling it out at hospitals nationwide. It's such a fantastic idea. That I'm sure there's so many parents over time that have said, well, this doesn't make any sense. There needs to be something better. And there it is. She really reached back to help people going through what she's been through. Brilliant.